Hello, good morning, noon and night, everybody. This is recording artist Prophet Drama. What does it mean to live? If and in today's video, I'm going to tell you four steps on how to make timeless art. And first, I'd like to thank our sponsor, DistroKid, for a discounted price on their sign-up. Link in the description. More on them later. Now, step one is going to be make art. Now, don't get overwhelmed here. Just take it easy. Take a nice stroll somewhere or stay home. And next you want to grab something like a phone. If you've got an iPhone, there's GarageBand. Or if you have a PC or laptop, there is Audacity. Both of those are free to download. And just make some noise, you know? Don't take it so seriously. Just have some fun. Cause some anger. Let some emotions out, you know? Or not. Be happy too. You can use pretty much anything, like right here we got this little plate, okay? We just go. What does it mean to live if I don't make it clear what good it And there you go, look at that, we have a full song. Step two is to find God and separate from the art. And this has a lot of subcategories, I'm going to try and sum it up very, very quickly. Let go. Just have an out-of-body experience and just separate. Soul's gone. You're free. Don't so stay attached to it. It's not yours. Your soul is a separate entity from your body, from the physical plane here. We make that here. Let it go as if it was never a part of you. And don't give yourself too much time to judge it because you're your own worst enemy. Sitting and scrolling, comparing yourself to everything and everybody that you see. Good and bad is all perspective. It's all objective. You know, we've gotten to points in music where we have Kanye West's Poop to Scoop. <laughs> Tiny Tim and tiptoe through the two lips and to prophet dramas, no immortals. Like these are the lows or the mids or the highs. It's all perspective, you see. Oh, I'm so nervous. Step three. Step three. Step three is to stay away from trends and over influence. If you're an artist watching this and all you care about is numbers and being famous, you can probably watch a different video. I don't know what you're doing watching this one. And what I could ask you is to go to any of your favorite artists, top five, you know, the first ones that come to your mind. These people did things from inside and it became trends for other people to follow. And if you're making something only within a trend, that means it's only during a certain particular space of time. It's not meant to last forever. Making a conscious effort to only listen to your art while you're making your art to not be too influenced by other things on the outside. Step four, get yourself a DistroKid account. Start releasing music every week. Uh, even once a month's fine, quarterly, you know? I've released four albums in the last year um, just to be consistently putting out musical content. In the past, as a musician, I would never have released all that stuff because I did not follow the three First steps. And I'm offering you a 7% discount, link in the description, to sign up for DistroKid to start releasing way too much music on the internet and have X amount of people listening to it. But think about the long run and hundreds of years. Don't you just want your somebody to come across maybe one piece of art that you've come up with that might inspire them? to sleep on this couch and start making their art and sharing that with others to then do the same thing. This is our purpose in lives, people. We gotta keep the boat rolling. I hope you've had a grand time. I've been recording Ernest Prophet Drama and you've been beautiful. Good night, friends. What does it mean to live?